Good day, I'm Colin Dangard with the Australian Stock Saddle Company and today I'm going to show you how you put a monkey grip on a saddle. Monkey grips are wonderful things. You've got something to grab if you look like buying real estate and if you're leaning forward on your saddle uh, you don't get stuck in, the, stuck in your gut with a horn which is not a bad idea. So first of all we've got the ambiguous cowboy knot here. When you buy a monkey grip as an after, uh, after purchase buy this is what you're going to get. Now you get a pair of, of uh, needle nose pliers like this, and we're going to undo, undo that, undo that cowboy knot, which is simply a knot that has two slits in it, like that. Now you can put the one, put one part of that under here, and then you push it through that slit, like this here. There it is, going through there. Right now, you pull that up there, and now you have the other slit there. Now you push that through that slit. And this knot's been around for hundreds and hundreds of years, probably thousands of years really, because it doesn't need any hardware to put it. Now, the more you pull that knot, the tighter it gets. And of course, you just do the thing with the other side. Okay, now there's a real lazy way to do this too. You can put the monkey grip here if you want, just unscrew that screw, unscrew that screw, and then thread that bracket through here like that. And then you can screw it up, screw it up again, and there it is, done that way an easy way, which is uh, being the lazy person I am, that's what I do. If I can uh, lay down, I don't sit. If I can uh, go to sleep, I don't like being awake. So there you go. That's the lazy way. So that's what putting on a monkey grip is all about. It's a nice handle. Actually, you'll hardly ever reach for it. You're going to use these knee pads, of course, once you realize they're there. But what it's really good for a monkey grip is lifting the saddle. It's a place you can grab onto.